how is it that each of our traditions has such words of compassion and such principles of love and we have created the kind of world we have created. You know, just before coming here, I was reading an article where there were some clergy who were going to help or trying to help some street gangs. And the street, street gang leaders said, you can't help us. And the clergy said, why? And they said, because you are just like us. So what do you mean? He says, like us, you mark off your territory and you defend to the death your right to hold it. You're just like us. So I'm not talking about the institution of religion. We are not. We're talking about the spirituality within the religion. And the other thing that is important for those of us who are Christians to understand and name is the reality that the the demonization, let's say, of the Arabs and Muslims goes back a long way. Demonization by Europeans and Americans, at least to the middle of the 19th century. And we have to realize that that ability to put down the people of the Middle East has been supported by actions of the Christian church. And so we need to reverse that. We need to recover that sense of love. Prophet Muhammad said, seek knowledge from the cradle to the grave. In this case, knowledge about the other, the other's religion, other's culture, other's grievances, pains, anguish, suffering. How do you do that? All the traditions have answers, similar answers. The Quran says, will you not listen? Will you not listen? The truth is, Muslim or non-Muslim, we are not listening. What seems to happen is each tradition has moments of awakening. And every awakening is the same. Every awakening is essentially to oneness. And at that moment, violence against one's neighbor, against oneself, against one's planet is impossible. So we can talk about the abiding principles, the beautiful teachings in each of our traditions that an event like 9-11 reminds us to hold more openly, more fervently, to live more completely. But we have to recognize our propensity to forget. And we have to commit ourselves at moments of forgetting to remember that a forgetting has been and to awaken again. <laughs>